Let's set up a lead vocal chain using Xbox for iPad. First, I'll load up Xbox as an insert on our lead vocal track. I've looped a section of the verse of this track so we can start working with that. There's a couple different workflows we can choose from. The first is to just flip through presets and find a good starting point. We can then tweak it from there. Another way we can do it is start from scratch and dial it in ourselves. Let's start by checking out some presets, but then we'll come back and dial it in from scratch so we can really dig into all these controls. You make me want it. The way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it How you act make me wonder if you in or out You take me for granted No making excuses, got a lot to do So you can see there's a wide range of presets. Some have really big reverbs, some are really tight and clean. I really like this clean lead preset as a good starting point. And from here I could just tweak it a little bit to fit this song perfectly. You make me want it the way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it How you act You make me want it The way that you got me overthinking now It instantly adds a ton of life to this vocal. There's over a hundred presets that come with Xbox. A ton of great starting points. I heard several in there that we could have used. But for the sake of this video, let's actually go back to the default. And we're going to dial this chain in from scratch. It's super easy to do, even if you've never mixed a vocal before. Let's start with the dynamics module and dial in some compression. You make me want it the way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it The compressor brings the vocal right to the front of the mix. It makes it sound a lot smoother and more consistent. I generally will look at this gain reduction meter and try to shoot for between 6 and 12 dB of gain reduction for a good starting point. You make me want it The way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it we can also swap between these different compression algorithms for some different flavors. Opto plus FET is going to be transparent and smooth. VCA plus FET is going to be punchy and aggressive. And 2 plus FET is going to be warm and full of analog flavor. In this case, I like Opto plus FET. After compression, I like to bounce over here to the tone module and dial in the vocal tone. You make me want it. The way that you got me overthinking now. I can tell that you want it. How you act make me wonder if you in or out You take me for granted Again, we can swap the different tone modes here, and as we do that, you'll see the curve actually changing to reflect the different tone. Modern is super crisp, it's great for adding life and air to a vocal. Clear is great for a clean vocal tone that cuts through the mix. And vintage is great for adding warmth and analog character. You make me want it the way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it How you act make me wonder if you in or out On this track, I really like modern. A touch of the air plus slider goes a long way as well. You make me want it The way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it I also like to use this high pass filter to cut off any low end rumble that we don't need in our vocals. After dialing in the tone, I like to go back to the dynamics module and dial in the de-esser. So to dial in the de-esser, I like to loop a section of the track that has a lot of sibilant sounds, S and T sounds. Then I'll simply dial in this de-esser until I'm only seeing that de-s meter move on those sounds. This is just going to smooth out any harshness there. Oh, you take me for granted. No making excuses, got a lot to do I'm over the road, you take me for granted No making excuses, got a lot to do This de is super clean and transparent, so it's not going to add any artifacts and it's going to take away all the harshness. Let's listen before and after our dynamics and tone module has been dialed in. The way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it how you act make me wonder if you in or out You take me for granted No making excuses Already we've got a much cleaner vocal that's sitting right at the front of the mix. Let's add some reverb and delay with the space module. The way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it How you act make me wonder if you in or out You take me for granted No making excuses, got a lot to do the way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it How you act make me wonder if you in or out Sounds really nice and lifelike. We've got a bunch of different spaces to choose from as well, which gives us a ton of different flavors. Let's listen to some of these. The way that you got me overthinking now I can tell that you want it How you act make me wonder if you in or out You take me for granted no making excuses, got a lot to do. Cause I'm over the road.
there's a ton of different options to choose from. You got everything from super long, lush reverbs all the way to short, tight ambiences, and even some cool effects like Infiniverb. On this track, I like Dark Hall. It's nice and warm, but it doesn't get in the way. The way that you got me overthinking now can tell that you want it. How you act make me wonder if you in or out. You can see we've also got finer control over the delay by choosing the rate. The way that you got me overthinking now can tell that you want it. How you act make me wonder if you in or out. You on this track, I like the eighth note delay. Now let's add some thickness with the SFX module. We've got some different effects here. We've got doublers, analog modeled chorus, some modulation, saturation, and more. So let's take a listen to some of these. The way that you got me overthinking now can tell that you want it. How you act make me wonder if you in or out. You take me for granted. No making excuses, got a lot to do. The pitch widener is a special type of doubler. It sounds very natural and wide, but I also like this analog model chorus because it's a little bit more subtle, but it adds a ton of body and thickness. The way that you got me overthinking now can tell that you want it. Let's go with just a small amount of that in the mix. Let's listen before and after Xbox on this lead vocal. The way that you got me overthinking now can tell that you want it. How you act make me wonder if you in or out. It's an amazing transformation and we were able to do it really quickly with Xbox. Let's go ahead and save this as a preset of our lead vocal chain. You can see now we have our user presets and we have our lead vocal chain saved here. Now I can load this up on our other lead vocal tracks and quickly load the preset up. 